Hey guys, it's Brett with Big and Norm Fishing, and today I pulled out the majority of my fishing rods and reels, um, about half of which are new to me or brand new. Um, I have them lined up from the lightest action to the heaviest action, so uh, let's get started. Uh, the first rod that I have here is actually the only spinning combo that I really use. It's a Cabela's Torney Trial IM8. It's a 6.6 rod uh, that's medium action. I have it paired up with a Fluger President reel. Um, I believe this is actually the smallest model of the present that you can get. And I mainly use this rod for drop shots and wacky rigs. Um, it's extremely light, uh, but it's been durable. I haven't had any issues with it at all. Um, I really love this combo. And actually my wife usually uses this combo due to the fact that it is as light as it is. Uh, she really likes this rod and reel. Next up is uh, my topwater setup. Uh, this is a Bass Pro Bionic Blade rod. Uh, it's a six foot medium and it is paired up with a Bass Pro Shops Pro Qualifier Reel and a six four to one gear ratio. Um, this is what I use for all of my walking baits as well as my poppers. Um, I like that it's six foot um, due to the fact that I mainly fish out of a kayak and having this be a little bit shorter when I'm walking baits, um, I, don't, I don't end up hitting the rod tip off, off the water. Um, which ends up working out pretty nice. The next rod and reel that I have here, this is the newest rod and reel that I have. Well, it's used, um, but really, really cool story behind it. Um, my dad, um, who is big of Big and Norm, uh, he was in North Carolina visiting my little sister and they went into a pawn shop. Um, and I happened to call him when he walked in and he was looking around at the fishing gear and he told me that they had a cron arc on a on a rod for forty dollars and i was like see if you can walk with it man like see what you can do and he ended up walking out of the store with this combo for 30 bucks um there is absolutely nothing wrong with this at all it is a shimano kumara rod it's a seven foot medium action rod uh paired up with a shimano cron arc uh reel and a seven zero to one gear ratio um, this this combo is worth every bit of four hundred dollars, and uh, he got it for thirty bucks cash. So uh, look around if you see garage sales, yard sales, pawn shops, anything like that. You never know what you can walk out of a store with. Um, I'm mainly going to be using this setup for um, soft plastic jerk baits, weightless sankos, hard jerk baits, rattle traps, um, anything with treble hooks really, square uh, square bell crank baits. I don't really do a whole lot of deep diving uh, cranks but uh, I've played around with this I tuned it up I cleaned it lubed it everything like that and um, it's it's just it's a fun rod and reel to play around with it really is um, I'm excited to catch a lot of fish on it next up is one of the two new favorite rods that I got this is the favorite uh, defender series this is the seven foot medium heavy um, I have this paired up with a Daiwa Tatula and a 7 to 1 gear ratio. Um, I, I'm really, really pumped up about this combo. Um, back in Pittsburgh where I'm from, there's a Gander Mountain that's, uh, that's going out of business. And I was able to get this Tatula for like $110, something ridiculously cheap. And um, this rod was um, a Christmas present from... Uh, from from big for my dad and uh, I'm really really excited to, to get this stuff out on the water uh, again I've taken this out I've fished it um, being that it's as cold as it is I haven't had much luck but this is another rod and reel combo that it's it's just a joy to, to fish it's a lot a lot of fun um, so the last rod and reel on here the rod is actually um, the rod that I made my last video about this is the favorite rod company, Lunkers TV Signature Rod. It's the 7.3 Extra Heavy. Um, I have this paired up with the Shimano Corrado 70. Um, I also just recently got this as well. Um, I'm very, very excited to fish this. I plan on using, obviously, Texas rigs, jigs, flipping, pitching, punching, anything like that. Um, this Corrado model is made for lighter baits. Um, it doesn't have too much of a line capacity, but it, it can handle heavy. It, it's Corrado. It's going to do everything I need it to. Um, the reason I got this is 
I don't need a lot of line. I am not gonna be casting this. I don't plan on using this reel for swim baits or anything like that. This is gonna be, I'm gonna use this this rod probably 40 to 50% of the time next season. I love flipping and pitching. I love being um, around brush. I love being in grass mats. I love being around timber, anything like that. Um, so this is gonna get abused and uh, I'm excited to do it. I think it's gonna stand up to the test. Uh, again, I've taken this out. Haven't caught any fish on it. Obviously, it's snowing right now. I'm not going to be flipping and pitching and catching anything, but I was just excited to get it all tuned up and geared up. And uh, 2017 is going to be a really, really fun season. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, if you have any questions, anything like that, leave them in the comments section. Um, it's kind of cool. This channel is really new, but we have a couple videos that uh, have bumped up over you know, 70, 80 views now. And uh, the video that I put out on the Lunkers TV rod, I uh, just recently broke 200, which for YouTube, for a lot of people, that's that's nothing. But uh, for me, it's really, really, really cool. I'm excited. Um, big, my dad, the other half of this channel, he's really excited. So uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and uh, we'll see you later.